Easy work box. I'm about to hit you everywhere but under your feet with this one. This one for George, George Grove versus Chris Eubank. Now, you know, this is going to be a good fight right here. This is going to be, this is a 50 50 fight. I mean, really, you can't say who going to win in this one. Uh, you know, Groves, only three defeats, uh, two against Frotch, one against Badu Jack, uh, and Eubank Jr., one loss to Billy Joe Sanders. You know, now, one thing I think I saw that I didn't really like about this fight is the weight. To me, uh, Groves looks way bigger than Chris Eubank Jr. But, you know, a number of Chris Eubank Jr. opponents have looked bigger than him, and he didn't knock them out. So I don't think that's really going to be a problem. Maybe he just a fit uh, 160 pound, or I think he a super middleweight. Yeah, super middleweight. So, yeah, I think he just a uh, super middleweight that's always in shape because he always looks smaller than his opponents. Uh Chris Eubank, you know, great body puncher, great inside fighter, can move. You know, no one ever really talks about the defense he has. You know, he got good head movement for one. You know, he can move around the ring real good. And one thing I like is that he can smother your punches. You know, he uh he throw his combination and lean in and smother you. He gives the opponent no chance to try to hurt him or come back. George Groves, you know, combination puncher, uh, good boxing skills, can move around the ring pretty well. Uh, I think one of the problems with uh, Groves is that he liked to fight the way his opponents like to fight him. And I don't think that's a, that'll be a good fight for him this time. I honestly think that he should move around and box uh, Chris Eubank like Billy Joe Sanders did. Uh, I, and, and this fight right here will really tell where Chris Eubank has came up from since the loss to Billy Joe Sanders. See, now... So we can see now, can he really handle a boxer that can move, you know, because he came, that fight, he came in late, you know, by the sixth, fifth round, he started, you know, getting his, getting his little groove to where he could uh, hit and get on uh, Saunders. So we're going to have to see where he at now, you know, years on down the road fighting a boxer like Groves. Uh, my prediction for this fight is uh, Chris Eubank Jr. all the way. I see, uh, Chris Eubank stopping George Groves, honestly, by the ninth, tenth round. Uh, the body punching, the power, those uppercuts. Uh, Chris Eubank and those uppercuts, man, no, no, they some vicious. So, uh, I don't see. Now, uh, Groves is also a good body puncher, too. He can punch to the body well, too. So, you know, like I said, it's going to be an all-around fight. It's a real 50-50 fight. But my prediction is he will, uh, Chris Eubank will defeat George Groves by ninth, 10th round by stoppage. I don't think he's going to be able to deal with the, uh, the punishment that Chris Eubank going to dish out. And plus, uh, Groves looks a little scared to me. You know, I said that in my first video that I had put up, uh, you normally see Groves trash talking or being in somebody's face, you know, uh, or trying to get on your nerves and get in your head. Groves not doing that. You know, he looks a little intimidated by Chris Eubank. And by them sparring before, I guess that could be the reason because he know what he really got to deal with the night of the fight. But uh, I see this as a good fight. Uh, I really think that a lot of fighters at middleweight are ducking Chris Eubank Jr., especially uh, Golovkin, Canelo. It's a number one when you mention this dude's name. So hopefully, uh, my prediction will come out right, I hope, and he defeats George Rose and he gets that belt. Then uh, I don't see no excuse for anybody to be trying to duck him. But, you know, uh, like I said, uh, no disrespect to the Groves fans out there. You know, Groves is a great fighter, you know, a great boxer, but I just don't see him winning this fight nor being – Chris Eubank Jr. So my prediction is Groves, I mean, no, Chris Eubank Jr. by stoppage, ninth to 10th round. I do not see this fight going in to 12 rounds. So easy work boxing. Comment, subscribe. Thank you for your time, man. Thank you.